Intelligent design is fully based on science, on the observation of the physical properties of biological systems, such as the machinery that uh, runs the cell and the information that is found in DNA. It is not a religious idea. It is not based on any religious books or on any revelations. Rather, it's just based on observation and our understanding that uh, intricate systems require intelligence uh, to put them together. There is a, a good analogy I like to use, and that is that uh, intelligent design is to religion as the uh, first uh, verse of Genesis about God creating the heavens and the earth uh, is to uh, the Big Bang Theory. Now, Christians have believed that, uh, er, that the universe was created in time, did not always exist, but many scientists up until the early 1900s disagreed. And, but then it was proposed, uh, the Big Bang Theory, that in fact the universe did have a beginning. And this was because astronomers saw that galaxies were flying away from each other as if in the aftermath of a big explosion. So the Big Bang Theory and Genesis both say that the universe began in time, but the Big Bang Theory rests exclusively on observations of nature, plus our understanding that when we see things flying away from each other, there was a, an explosion in the past. Uh, similarly, intelligent design doesn't rely on uh, the Bible or, or any revelations. It comes from our understanding uh, that when we see many things put together for a sophisticated function, uh, we always understand that uh, that was arranged, that was designed, a mind behind it, because we know that in the absence of a purpose and some, uh, some mind uh, putting parts together, uh, it's very unlikely that, that it would, uh, would uh, occur.